Hey, Jordan Bench here, jordanbench.com. In this video, I'm gonna share with you an apple cider vinegar and honey drink. Now, if you're someone who is just getting started with drinking apple cider vinegar, then this recipe is actually gonna be great for you to do because I think it's actually really easy to do and you should have most of these ingredients like right there in your kitchen. So, I need to say too, if you're doing intermittent fasting, then this recipe would technically break your fast because there's honey in it, so that's gonna cause a metabolic response and it's gonna kick you out of your fast. So if you're doing intermittent fasting, then this is not gonna work during your fasting window, but you can still drink it um, during your, your normal feeding window. So anyways, um, the apple cider vinegar, um, I use Bragg's apple cider vinegar. I think it's probably the best you can get. Um, make sure you get it that has the mother in it. Um, that's where, like where all your nutrients are gonna be. But the apple cider vinegar, um, it's really good for your digestion. It's really good for gut health. If you're someone who has like candida yeast overgrowth, then this is actually going to help eliminate it. Um, this is like apple cider vinegar. It's really good for a detox, and it's also going to help stabilize your blood sugar levels. Now, I've done all. I've already done like several videos on apple cider vinegar already, so you can check out my channel to see some of them. But let me go ahead and show you some of the ingredients and what we're doing. And actually, like I said, this is very simple, minimal ingredients. So this is what it's going to do is it's um, basically going to help the apple cider vinegar taste better when you're drinking it. So if you're like, you know, you don't like apple cider vinegar, the taste of it because it's bitter. Well, this is going to help out. This is going to help get you to the point where you can drink apple cider vinegar. And it's really not going to be that pr much of a problem. So, so here's what we're working with. All right. So right here, you see the apple cider vinegar. Um, I have two tablespoons of it right here. Also, I have, um, this is just organic honey, but I would recommend you get raw honey. Um, I have a tablespoon of that. You can do like one, uh, one teaspoon to the uh, one tablespoon, somewhere in that range. It doesn't really matter. It's just really whatever you're looking for. And then optional, I have cinnamon. So the honey, um, the honey is really going to help with the taste of the apple cider vinegar. Because like I said, it can be like a little bit, um, like kind of like a bitter taste. Um, the, the honey is antifungal and it's antiviral. So that's going to help out. Also, it has powerful antioxidants in it. So that's going to help out as well. And it's going to boost your immune system. So the honey just all around is going to be a good bet. But like I said, it will kick you out of your fast. Um, and then the other thing too, is we have cinnamon and with cinnamon, um, you don't need to add a lot, just like maybe a pinch or so of it. It's going to help control your blood sugar levels. It's going to improve like your blood circulation and it's also going to aid in digestion. So these three ingredients are, you know, you're really looking at gut health specifically and just digestion. It's really going to help out with. But really the whole idea is that we drink apple cider vinegar. And if you're someone who struggles with it, then this is going to help it taste better. So you're going to be able to do it. So, you know, I'm someone who is like, if you don't like, if you don't like having uh, carrots, you know, you don't like eating vegetables. But if you can add a little bit of ranch to it, if that's going to help get you uh, to eat vegetables, then go ahead and do it, right? So for me, it's like if I need to add a little bit of honey to this to get me to drink outside vinegar, then okay, I can do it. It's going to help out, plus all the health benefits with it. So the other thing I need to say too is I'm using, um, um, I'm using warm water. So I've already heated it up in the kettle, but I'm using warm water, and that's just going to help mix everything together. Plus, I don't like drinking this stuff cold. I like drinking it warm. But you might be someone who likes drinking it cold, so that, that's up to you, really. Um, and I do know having the warm water, it is going to help with digestion as well versus cold water. And the other thing, too, I'm ha I have here a BPA-free straw. So this is going to help me. Um, like the apple cider vinegar, it can damage your teeth if you have a lot of it and it's concentrated. So the, the straw is actually going to help protect um, the enamel on my teeth. I wouldn't get too worried about worried about it, but just use use a straw and then just make sure you're using um, like make sure you're not just drinking it straight. So like I said, I have right here in my glass, I don't know, there's about 12, 14 ounces or so of water. So I already have it measured out. I have two tablespoons of the uh, Bragg's organic apple cider vinegar. I'm gonna add that. Then I have a tablespoon. I have a tablespoon here of the honey. Now, like I said, you don't have to do a tablespoon. If you want to do less than that, you definitely can. It's not a big deal. Um, if you want to do like a, a teaspoon or even two teaspoons, whatever, it's not that big of a deal. Um, and then for the cinnamon, you know what? You just do cinnamon to taste. So, you know, I could say you do like a quarter teaspoon, but really I just like to 
I just like to give it enough just so I can taste it. There you go. Sorry, I'm doing this with one hand and kind of have a hand tied up. So if this is like all over the place, I apologize. All right, I will take my straw and go ahead and mix this all up. There you go, Let's see if we can get in on there. Yep. All right, so there we go. I will go ahead and give this a taste, but it should just be, um, it shouldn't taste that, um, like that bitter or anything, it should be pretty good. Ooh, that's really good. Yeah, you're gonna like that. All right, so anyways, I hope you liked this video. If you did, go ahead and give it a like, give it a thumbs up. Also, um, if you have any questions for me about apple cider vinegar or um, just this recipe in general or maybe other recipes, go ahead and comment below. I'm gonna post um, in the description, I'll post uh, some other videos on apple cider vinegar as well. Also, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel already, then go ahead and subscribe to it, and I will see you in the next video.